Hey there, internet! Look at this! 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 Look at all of this! You know what that means? It means I'm home for the weekend! Hooray! Woo! Cheers! Excitement! Sincerity! Yay! Life! Unedited! So today, we are going to talk about ideas and creativity. Why? Well, because I personally couldn't come up with any ideas. Irony. So for the past couple days, I've kind of been boiling around in my brain hole the whole idea about ideas. You see, I've kind of always thought of myself as a creative person, but I've come to realize that there are people who are way more creative than me. I mean, take for example someone like Stan Lee. I mean, this guy basically made up every single Marvel superhero that is popular today. He didn't make up all of them, but he made up most of them, and that's a really impressive feat. And in college right now, I'm taking a whole bunch of classes related to film, and so obviously a large part of that is idea generation, and I've realized just how hard it is to come up with good ideas. I mean, pretty much anyone can come up with really terrible ideas, like a movie about a piece of grilled cheese that gets attacked by a shark, or a movie about a giant piece of chocolate that wants to turn into the moon. I totally just made those up off the very, very top of my head, by the way, that explains how terrible they are. But coming up with some kind of idea that actually has potential and merit and some purpose and some bigger meaning is really, really hard. And I've come to respect those people that have those kinds of ideas and that kind of creative brain. Because let's be real, having a creative brain and not any good ideas coming out of it creates people like me who just do stupid things like this on the internet. Sorry. But in light of this whole creative hoopla that's been going on upstairs in my brain, wanted to take just a moment, like pretty much the rest of this video, to pay honor to a man whose creative foresight and idea generation pretty much has shaped a large part of my life. And let me Google his name really quick so that I pronounce it correctly. Hold on. Alright, here we go. Hiroshi Yamauchi. Now, this is someone whom I'm guessing most of you have not heard of. However, this man was the president of Nintendo, you know, that little video game company. However, while most people do know of Nintendo as a video game company, most people do not know that up until, like, 1970, they were a playing card company. It wasn't until Yamauchi-san, that's how you say Mr. in Japanese, basically, by the way, came to be the head of the company that they stopped being a playing card company, although they do still make playing cards, and started being this great, huge video game thing that we know them today. You see, he always had this philosophy that ideas and creativity and fun should be the core of everything his company did. And that's why he hired people like Gunpei Yokoi, who invented the Game Boy, and Shigeru Miyamoto, who created the idea for, like, every successful game Nintendo has ever had. I'm talking Mario, Zelda, not Kirby you know, most of them. And so it was this one man who was essentially responsible via his own creativity and ideas to create this massive company that is like a third of a massive enterprise in today's world. That's video games if you're not tracking with me. Unfortunately, Hiroshi Yamauchi died a couple days ago, I think it was. And I don't want this to be some like super morbid thing just because he died. Instead, I wanted to take the opportunity, like I said, to honor him for being such a creative force in the world today, even though most of you have probably never heard of him. So there you go, that's my about like half a cent's worth on the whole concept of ideas and creativity. Sorry this wasn't that entertaining of a video. I'm really tired and I want to go to sleep. But anyway, let me know down in the comment section what's the best idea you've ever had? When were you at your most creative? And what did you do with that idea? Did you just let it slide or did you make something of it? My most creative idea was something about like a chocolate chip in the moon. So you know, I'm gonna keep working on it. Thanks for watching. I hope you'll click the little likey button and the little subscribey button. And if you'd even share this with your friends, that would be phenomenal. And until next time, internet, deuces.